Welcome back to G5 Building. No introduction, let's just get into it. All right, and these enemies have uh, invisible cloaks on, but got him. This sounds really good too. How did he miss me? So now it's fighting cloaked enemies in the dark. Yeah, no, um... Yeah, I was thinking, I really don't know whether I'm gonna do Mario World or Ocarina of Time next. I really don't know. It's very... It's a very hard decision. I, I feel like I really like both games. It'll probably be Mario World, honestly. Because Ocarina of Time is a let's play you have to be very committed to. That's a game you gotta put your time into. And I really don't know if I feel like putting time into it right now. There's another cool cutscene in this level. Oh. Uh, yeah, if you sound the alarm, you fail the mission, so you gotta really make sure you, that all the enemies are dead before you go up there. Okay. So we gotta crawl along this uh, wire thing. Okay. We've recovered the sapient from Carrington and altered its programming. It no longer has a personality, so there will be no further incidents. This will reduce its efficiency. My team will have to take it to the core themselves. This will endanger them. You should have anticipated that the sapient might develop a troublesome moral code. One could have predicted that, and I resent being singled out for blame. What about him? The president turned down your request for the loan of the project, too. Could it be you overestimated your influence over him? No. Perhaps I underestimated his resolve. We have a contingency plan ready to go. And we will move as soon as the presidential honorage arrives at the airbase. All I need from the president is a tissue sample. <laughs> Assuming you don't get any interference. If Carrington has pieced together enough of this, he will have called for reinforcements. There will be no outside help from Mr. Carrington. The technology you gave us is installed in Nevada and fully operational. We can intercept any craft they use. Then the devices we gave you are working correctly. Good, because we believe anything which does not work correctly should be destroyed. Consider that as you follow your backup plans. Okay, I just out of curiosity for me, is the camps by they in here still? Oh, they are. Huh, I didn't know they actually stayed in there. Okay, cool. Can I pick it back up? Nope, okay. No, we're not going to do that. No alarms will be triggered, not today. No, thank you. Die, okay. Ah, oh, this mission might not be as lengthy as I thought. This is basically the end of it right here. So I completely lied, okay. Cool. The issue is, I, I know for a fact I'm not lying. Uh, the mission after this is really, really long. So, this is probably going to be a very, very short episode. Which, I don't know. Alright, they're dead. Okay, they're gone. Good. Oh, uh, where is it? Then I'm there? Okay. Uh, fucking do. There we go. So, uh, so, we need that vault to open. And we need to fend off the door. From people, so... I want the gun to drop. Where is it? Nope, it didn't drop it. There it is. Oh! Wrong thing. Yep, the DY-357. 
It's one shot. It takes a while to reload. But it's also one shot, and that is very useful for this level. Oh, is that someone in there? Nope, okay. Ah, uh, alright, that is cool, cool to die, okay. Shut the door, come on. Grab it, yep. No time for that now, Agent Dark. There's been a development during radio silence. The crowd carrying those friends I was talking about was shot down in Nevada. The weapon responsible was found from Area 51. That's where the survivors and debris will have been taken. You're to prep for immediate dispatch when you return here. Carrington out. Area 51? What about President? And I am going to let the opening cutscene of this level play, but we're not going to do it. Because I feel like this, the, 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 the uh, I can't speak, okay, cool. The cutscene, the opening cutscene for this level is decently sized. And, you know, I, I, I mean, I, six minutes is pretty short for seven minutes now, so I'll just let it play out. Very cool cutscene. Okay, Joanna, take a look at this. Our operative inside Area 51 was able to get this out to us. This is your entry point, a deserted helipad on the edge of the base. The lift down to the hangars and the rendezvous point is beyond that wall. Watch out for these guards. Here's the communications antenna. Attach a comms rider bug so we can talk to you when you're inside the base. Again, watch out for hostiles. Oh my god. Here is our friend. He appears to be physically in heart, though he hasn't regained consciousness yet. By the look of it, the surgeons are almost done with their preliminary tests, and will begin dissection soon. Any questions? No. Good. Away you go to the hangar. Agent Dark, mission log, 10 28 hours. Against my better judgment, I'm about to enter Area 51. And that is going to be next episode. I feel bad cutting you off like that, but I also really don't. So I will see you guys next time when we infiltrate Area 51.